Hey guys, today I wanted to do a video going over my setup and just my room that I put all my Nerf guns in that I kind of changed up so it can fit more guns and it looks a lot nicer now. So the first thing I want to talk about is some of the upgrades. So I have a nice editing computer here. Probably as you noticed in my other older videos, I was just sitting on the ground. That's because I had no table or chair or anything. So now I have some nice bean bags and my computers and everything for editing and I have a headsets and everything for playing video games and stuff. And right above that, you'll see this is my rack where I just have all my modded guns. These are not all of them, but this is most of them. Uh, you can see I have my long strike and uh, recon, I think. My uh, elite recon that I painted. Um, there's some parts. There's my strife. There's my cool demolisher everyone seems to like. Um, here's a parts bin right there. Yeah, so this is just that area. Um, that is for sale, by the way, if you're interested in that. But And then over here, I have all like my other stuff. So I have two rough cuts for some reason. I have a inbox strife. I have a uh, mag. Don't know why that's there. I have a ton of mags right here. As you can see, I have my Worker 22 Dart mag. I'm going to hopefully make a review on this, cause, just because I think it's necessary. Because I was, uh, when I was looking at buying either a P mag or a 22 mag, I was kind of, kind of confused what I should get. And there weren't too many U YouTube videos about it, so I'm going to probably make a video about this. Just going over some of its features and stuff. Yep. And then I've got a whole bunch of other mags there. Centurion, Zeus, two swords, my uh, battle belt that you've probably seen in my loadout video. That just sits here on the rack with uh, that also, also that belt, nerf belt, the uh, nerf chest thing, and strike chest attachment. Oh, the lighting's getting really bad. Okay, um, I have a whole bunch of in package bullets. I have about 800. No, uh, yeah, I have about 800 bullets in package over there in a box, and then I have a big bin of loose starts that I just use for. Wars or something like that, or anytime I just need to shoot a gun, just kind of grab a bunch of those loose starts. And then also want to talk about, uh, this is a really big improvement. I have some ni really nice lights now, so when I'm filming a video, it's usually going to be on that table. And I just kind of drag my lights over here, like this. And, see? So now I can just have, and they're all LED lights except for the top one, which I'm going to replace. So I can have some really good lighting for my videos now. So that's a big improvement. I'm also going to try to be improving my um, audio quality. I don't know what I'm going to do about that yet. I think I'm going to get some sort of microphone or speaker. I was thinking about like using these, like this headset, but I really have no idea. So, um, yeah, this is kind of just uh, my new setup. Um, I will. Oh, uh, I will be making a video on this, an unboxing on this, but this is the uh, first canted flywheel cage i think i already uploaded a video on this but yeah i love this i'll be in putting this into uh that gun and uh trying it out but that will be another video but yeah check that out um yeah so this is just kind of my uh setup i've got now uh thanks for watching guys and have a good day